First, open your browser and you type obs.ninja. Press enter. Okay, let us maximize this window. Just click this arrow down to have more options, okay? So for now, I'm just going to discuss the two items, the camera and the remote screen share, okay? Just explore this amazing website. Now, click the camera. Permission denied. Okay, just close this one and click this camera icon. See, click this one and it should be always allow. Okay, and click done. Now, let us refresh the page. Okay, refresh. Okay, now, click again the camera. Okay, there you go. Here, we have video source and audio source. Okay, in video source, just click this arrow down okay you have now options which video feed you are going to use which video encoder you can use vmix video obs or webcam max or whatever but for now i'm just going to use this vmix video and click this setting for the video resolution i'm going to use maximum resolution now next the audio source click this one you can choose whatever audio you want, but as for me, I'm just going to disable my audio, okay? I will click no audio. So, here, you can also add password, but for now, I'm just going to leave it a blank. Now, let's go back to our vMix. You can use OBS as an encoder, but for now, I'm going to use vMix because I use my OBS to record this tutorial, okay? We're going to feed this video. So just click play and click external. So let's go back to our browser. Okay, here we already receive the video of our vMix. Okay, now click start. This video is coming from our vMix. Okay, see? Oh, see this one? See? Okay, let's go back to our browser. Do you notice this link? Whoever have this link can view your video. Okay? So, just click this one to copy. Copy to clipboard. And I'm going to paste it in the word pad. Whoever have this link can view your video. This streaming. Okay? To check this one, we're going to use another computer. Let us check if you can see the video. So, let's go to the other computer and open vmix okay so add input okay and uh, this is the link okay this is the link now we copy this one and add input and here web browser and you paste it here okay and click okay now just wait for few seconds now click play there you go so and i'm going to minimize this one so there it is whoever have this link will receive your video okay so let's go into forward this one okay see mm, see or if you want to change this one into this video fade okay oh, see so that's it actually this is like a vmix call but i guess this is much more better than vmix call because there are some functions here that we cannot find in vmix call so now let's go back to another option which is the remote screen share okay now here click select screen to share okay see as you can see you have three options entire screen which is actually in my computer i have dual screen the screen one and the second screen okay and you can choose also window meaning all the applications that is running in your computer see all of this you can see it here okay and the chrome tab we're running this video ninja okay now for example we're going to 
choose second screen okay you can also share the system audio or not but for now i'm just going to disable it and click share okay no audio was detected okay because we disable it just click x okay now so this is the one so if i'm going to open this put it here okay see mm. and again you can use this link to view this screen just copy it and let's say we are going to view it in our vmix click add input and click web browser and you paste it here okay just wait for a few seconds okay play so this is it okay see if i'm going to move it here see it also moves okay so that's it and one more thing you can use also the camera of your cell phone to feed it in your vmix just open the link obs.ninja and then open the camera of your cell phone and you copy the link of it and you send it to the vmix operator and voila the vmix operator can see the camera of your cell phone click add input and click web browser and you paste it here just wait for a few seconds so this is it okay see we successfully input the camera in our vmix okay yeah. assuming that this is the remote we do. yeah what can you say like and subscribe. Just like and subscribe. <laughs> okay, so actually this is this is very good if you are doing an uh, live live uh, report. Okay, if if your uh, reporter just have a cell phone and uh, you need to feed it in the studio, so you can use this actually. This is very good. Yeah. Okay, just open the OBS that Ninja and then just uh, open uh, the camera of your cell phone and give the link of it to the vmix operator and just like this see okay just like this he can now view the camera of your cell phone okay if you learn something just please don't forget to like and subscribe okay thank you very much bye-bye bye-bye bye besties